I love the comedy festival. There were so many comics on my plane, we had to go through an insecurity checkpoint. <laughs> it was so fun. I don't get out much. This is big for me. I'm addicted to the internet. Anybody else here think they're addicted to the internet? I check into the hotel. I try to go online on my laptop. It doesn't work. So I call the front desk. The lady's like, sorry, sir. We don't have internet service in all our hotel rooms, but don't worry. We have free wireless in the lobby. Lady, I don't think you understand. <laughs> oh my gosh. This girl asked me out one time, she told me she was an actress in porno movies. So I was like, all right, well, when do you wanna go out? She says, well, I'm working Tuesday and Wednesday. How about Thursday? Uh, how about Monday? <laughs> One time my girlfriend and I, we rented a Jewish porno movie. It's called, I Don't Do That. <laughs> Have you seen that one? It's a sequel to Get That Thing Out of My Face. <laughs> which I think was a remake of Ew. You know, back in the States, the economy's falling apart. My friends are losing their jobs. The Starbucks near my house closed down. I had to walk across the street to the other Starbucks. <laughs> I saw my nephews the other day. That was really fun. I have two nephews. I took them to Disneyland, you know. He'd never been on a roller coaster before, so you have to be 37 inches to go on Space Mountain, right? So he just makes it 37 inches. Right? We go on Space Mountain, it's mind-blowing, you know? Afterwards, of course, he has to pee. We go to the men's room, and my nephew, he's just tall enough now where he can use the regular urinal. He doesn't have to use the little guy urinal on the end, but he can barely reach, so he has to, you know, rest it right on top. <laughs> he looked at me, he was so proud. And he looked at the guy next to us, he's like, I'm 37 inches. Guy's like, I guess you win, kid. <laughs> to forget Disney, join the circus. <laughs> I feel a lot of love in the room tonight. I want to try something special. I wrote a love poem, but I, got a, I asked for a keyboard, but I don't play keyboard. I need someone to come up and play, anyone at all. I don't care how old, male or female, just to play a few chords. It'll be really fun. Uh, somebody? Sir, your hand? Okay, come up here. Oh my gosh. How you doing, sir? Oh my God, it's like Kenny G with diabetes. <laughs> I'm not sure this is a good idea. How's it going, man? What's your name? It was going pretty well up to now. My name's Scott. Are you mocking me? Are you mocking me, Scott? Whoa! No, no, no. Whoa, what was... Okay, go. All right. Guy thinks he's Mozart if he got hit by a bus. <laughs> Who does your hair, a weed whacker? <laughs> the same guy does yours. <laughs> That was good. Don't get mad. <laughs> no. We're a good team, Scott. Well, it's been a long time, but 45 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here's a love poem. Little change of mood. Play something romantic. Wow, you're good. Can we, uh, can we dim the lights a little bit? <laughs> Perfect. Here's a love poem. It's called, Hey, Wait a Minute. <laughs> her long tan legs, her dark bedroom eyes, her soft, sexy voice, her large protruding Adam's apple. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> Fun. That's pretty good. 
Was that all right? Huh? Was, did that, was the moose right? Perfect, thing? you're awesome. It's the words that are so touching. <laughs> <laughs> Who taught you how to play so well? I don't remember. <laughs> how just, messed up are you right now? <laughs> What'd you do, roofie yourself? <laughs> do you have any more uh, poems? <laughs> yes. There's a love poem. Maybe you want to join hands if you're with someone you love. <laughs> this poem's called, please, some music. What's it about? It's sad. So, it's about love. Sad. This poem's called, I think we should see other people. Roses are red. Get the hell out. <laughs> All right, I love you guys. Thank you so, so much. Say bye, everybody. Bye.